It's finally time to clean this poor old woman's bathroom. And if you're new here, my name is Brogan and I do multiple free cleanings a week for those struggling with mental and or physical health that are living in unlivable conditions. I have a lengthy background in psychology and have studied the correlation between mental health and cleaning for many years. So I use my platform to help spread awareness, give advice, tips, and knowledge on the subject. This case was an emergency cleaning for an older woman who was about to be evicted from her home if something wasn't done. So I cleared my schedule and have been back almost every single day this week. Now this bathroom was the most important thing on my list. It was absolutely heartbreaking knowing she was living alone in these kind of conditions. Mental health did play a huge part in the accumulation of this mess, but mental health also equally takes the biggest toll because of these conditions. Just knowing that she was keeping and reusing old toilet paper breaks me because I know exactly how bad she must feel inside. I ended up removing two industrial sized garbage bags worth of used toilet paper and pads alone, and I realized she had not one single new roll. On top of that, the cat's litter box was in there full of old litter and garbage making it completely unusable which explains the urine and feces throughout the home once these kind of things build up they can go out of control very quickly and it can be extremely overwhelming and leaves people absolutely debilitated this is the perfect example of why i do my free cleanings because if i didn't step in and help this woman lord only knows what would have happened to her now she has a clean home toilet paper a fresh slate and lots of cleaning supplies